Paul Jiu is the business manager of Kim Jiu Photography Studio, a company that creates custom portraits for families, high school seniors, children, and executives. In recent years, however, the recession has negatively impacted his company. In order to seek some innovative solutions to these challenges, Jiu has decided to go undercover. Hey, I am no longer going to be the business manager of Kim Jiu Photography Studio. I've decided to go undercover. We've really been facing lots of challenges with this economy, so I'd like to go on the front lines and see how well our people are coping with things. And hopefully, I'll be able to come back with some new ideas on how we can handle things. I think that's a great idea. However, I think your biggest challenge is going to be disguising your identity. I think most people know what you look like. Well, to help with that, I've uh, enlisted the services of a professional makeup artist, and hopefully, we'll be able to, to do that well. Paul has enlisted the services of a professional makeup artist to disguise his identity. He is hoping that this disguise will be enough for him to go undercover. <clears throat> Paul is visiting one of the studios as a photographer trainee. His trainer has been told that a documentary is being created about fast food employees transitioning into other lines of work. Hi Jessica, my name is Anthony. Hi, nice to meet you. I'm going to be training to be a photographer today with you. Great, cool. So you have an interest, obviously. I sure do. Good, good. And have you ever shot with one of these? Just a little bit, just a little bit. Okay, okay. Well, I'll show you a few things today. Okay. And okay, so I'll... I'm just going to hand, hand off the camera to you and you can shoot away and show me what you got. Great. Okay. Thank you. Around. Down your belly for me. And why don't you bring both hands right underneath your chin. And bring your feet back and cross your feet. Make some little bunny ears for me. There we go. Look over here. Give me a big smile. Get it right there. Look over here. Let me get focus here. Have some trouble focusing. There we go. Good. One more time. Good. Perfect. Why don't you go ahead and stand up for me? How am I doing so far? Um. Okay. That looks good. I like that. Good. Having some fun. Okay, I want you to stand right there. I want you, in fact, why don't you come right over here and look at this chandelier. I want you to grab one of these little, these little crystals right there. I want you to look right there. Just stare at it. And kind of turn your eyes right towards me. There you go. Good. Perfect. Good. One more time. Good. Smile. Great. Right. Do some poses. Why don't you put your hands behind your head. Just this and stuff like that. Yeah, real nice and sexy. There you go. Good. Right there. Perfect. Then we get focus. Good. Right there. Hold on. Perfect. Why don't you go away and cross your arms for me. Kind of kick back a little bit more. Good, right there is good. There you go, good. You're looking sexy. There we go. Hold on one second. Good, perfect. And uh, you know, I always kind of like that little, that little shot from the side. Why don't you go ahead and do something like this? Put your hands on your hip for me. There you go. Put, there you go. Put your together. Good. There you go. Good. Right there is good. Perfect. Good. Let's go here. You kind of stand there. Kick up your leg. Good. Right there is good. Turn. Drop your shoulder a little bit towards me. Make a good, good picture. Good. Perfect, good. Why don't you stand there straight looking towards me? Why don't you just like blow a kiss right towards me? I don't think Anthony would be a very good photographer. I mean, you just don't pose macho guys like girls. So Jessica, do you have any kids? I do actually. I have six children. Um, I had them before the age of 20. Wow. Been... Six kids? Yeah, it's been a little bit tough. Single mom and trying to support support everybody. Wow, you got through some difficult times. Yeah, I have. I really admire Jessica for raising six kids on her own. Paul is next going to work in the digital retouching department. This department enhances portraits by removing imperfections. Hello, Tim. Hi. Hi, my name is Anthony. Hi. I'm here to learn some retouching from you. Great. Why don't you go have a seat and I'm going to show you some uh, retouching techniques that we, we do here at the studio. Great. Okay. What we're going to do here is on this image, I'm going to show you this technique that we do is where we uh, replace a head, called a head swap. So we'll take this head off this person over here and we get a better expression, you know, because in this one his, his eyes are closed. So let's swap it over here like this. Just hit the shift key, select, drag it over. And there we go. Wow, come on, great. So you want to give it a try? Sure. Okay. So uh, you said uh, go ahead and circle the head. Yeah, right about here? Yeah, you use lasso tool, okay. select. Okay, good. Okay, and then uh, make a layer. Go ahead and hit the Apple J button. Apple J, good. Okay, okay. and then drag that over to the other one. 
Okay, good. Yeah, right there, good. Like yeah. Okay. Okay. And now flatten the layer. There you go. Okay. Good. Not too bad. Okay. I guess that's good. I really don't think Anthony has what it takes to be a retoucher. You know, his work is substandard. You know, he's goofing around on the images. It just doesn't look professional. Okay. So Tim, what's your average day like? Well, my average day is uh, I come in early in the morning um, and uh, I work till about noon and then uh, I have to go uh, do my dialysis. Uh, I have a kidney disease and uh, so that takes uh, quite a bit of time and then I have to come back later and uh, make up the rest of my hours. Uh, so I'm here pretty late and that's, that's you know, Monday to Friday, um, you know, it's pretty much my schedule. Wow, that's uh, really intense. You have to go through kidney, yeah. Yeah, it is. kidney dialysis. Yeah. Wow. I greatly admire Tim uh, and his courage to be connected to it, to a kidney machine on a daily basis and still work full time. I want to see how I can help him out. I have really learned a lot from going undercover. I respect my team and want to help them out. Jessica and Tim have been called to company headquarters. They have been told that they are to give an opinion of Anthony's potential as a worker. Hi Jessica. Hi. Do you know who you've been working with this week? Um, the trainee Anthony. Well, I have news for you. This week I went undercover and I was disguised as Anthony. So you've been working with me all week. Wow, really? Yep, that was me. Wow. And you know, I was so impressed working with you, uh, Jessica. You're an outstanding photographer. You do a great job of photographing our clients and they're, they're all happy whenever you're serving them. And uh, you did a great job of training me. I just really appreciate all the, the patience you had with me as you were training me. Uh, but one of the things that I was really impressed most about with uh, was the fact that you had six kids by the time you're 20 years old. And uh, you have been raising these kids uh, with uh, on your own with your with your salary so I really was impressed and touched by your story and I want to do something that will help you so to help put food on the table for you what I'd like to do is I'd like to give you um, six coupons for Happy Meals I work so hard to put food on the table for my six kids and this is how he pays me in coupons Hi Tim Hi you know who you've been working with this past week? Yeah, I've been working with that new guy, Anthony. Well, I have news for you. That was actually me, disguised as Anthony. What? I was uh, working undercover this week, and I wanted to just find out how you and all of the rest of our people were doing on the front line, so that was actually me. That's incredible. Yeah. You know, I, I really enjoyed working with you, Tim. You're an outstanding retouch artist, and I really enjoyed um, how you had patience with me as I was learning retouching and you're just a credit to our company but uh, the thing that impacted me the most was your personal story I just uh, can't believe uh, what kind of uh, hardship you've been going through uh, having kidney disease and uh, coming in in the mornings then leaving in the afternoons to get dialysis done and then coming back in the evenings to uh, finish your shift and I'm just really really impressed with uh, with your commitment, your loyalty, and your hard work in spite of uh, your, your life circumstances. So um, one of the things that I'd like to do is, is help you with um, okay. your, your health issues. So um, I know that um, I just went to the grocery store and um, I wanted you to have this can of uh, kidney beans to help you with your kidneys. So uh, this is just something that uh, hopefully will help you feel a little bit better uh, with uh, dealing with your, your disease.